Hey, my love. Hey. Hello. Hello. I'm busy doing. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Welcome to the episode. So today, I'm actually recording this from the future, about a week in the future from the next footage clips that you're seeing. This is actually when we started doing vlogs, okay? So this was my first time vlogging in the gym, vlogging, going out, hang out with hang, just showing you guys our day. And I think especially that I'm leading up to my contest prep, it's gonna be so much more valuable for me to show you what I do in a day-to-day -day life so you can actually see how I implement these things and live by example. So we'll take you through our upper body workout. I trained with my two other friends, Ray and uh, David, and then I'll end up going to the city, hanging out, upgrading all my gear so that I can actually do the vlogs and record footage, better quality content, upgrading my gear, upgrading my game. This year, I'm actually committing to being much more active on YouTube. You can actually see there, that's actually the light that we use when we film all our videos. It's a huge light that takes up so much space. Uh, our room is actually super, super messy because we've got like so much equipment and gear. And this is actually all the gear that, um, I'm currently gonna be selling, you can see there. But let me know what you guys think of the, about the vlogs. It's only gonna get better, which makes it so much more exciting. I'm only gonna get better and better. It's actually one of those things that is symbolic for life, right? At the start, you might be nervous when you start, or you, know, you might not be sure, you don't know how it's gonna be. It's only gonna get better, right? You can't get to your third video without doing your first, you can't get to your hundredth one. I'm actually super excited. I think for me, documenting this journey of my contest is more for myself and I hope you guys enjoy it. It's just so I can look back one day and know exactly what I did and be able to improve every single day. So it's just like how you write in a diary. This is my visual diary. Hope you guys enjoy it. Oh, also, I'm also showing you the footage of when we went to Nutrition Capital to do our 14 day challenge promotion. Unfortunately, we actually lost some of that footage don't know where it is, but we'll make do. It's not the worst thing in the world. And from the moment that you watch this video, I actually have so much more footage. We vlog for the whole week, proper exciting content. So I'm really, really gonna put an effort in to try to edit this week. And the episodes are actually gonna be a little bit different to the ones you watched previously. No special effects, um, no fancy stuff, because I just don't have that time. And I think you guys would rather just see the content rather than the special effects anyway. But anyway, I want to eat just like first sweet. time was sweet for me, the second time was savory for me. So like when yeah. I did my second comp for some reason, I got sweet but it switched to savory. Yeah. I couldn't get enough of grilled burgers. That's I just me. got a big That's her. That's she me loves right savory. Now. In the morning she'll have like scrambled eggs and toast, I'll have like French toast. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. Got like maple syrup and like all of the different toppings. Alright, but this is what we've got so far. We've got um prize one. This will be oh, this is for us. And then we'll get maybe like a custard full variety as opposed to, I'll get that. All right guys, so we just got done with uh, Nutrition Capital. Super, super nice guys. You should check out all the prizes that we have ready for you. Um, so there'll be first and second prizes. This video we uploaded after we announced the challenge. So first prize is protein and um, what is it, Oxy Shred, and also some samples. Second prize is the, the custard protein. Um, the Golden Gate Time Custard Protein, and then the rest of our other stuff is just for us. But yeah, super excited to announce the 14 day challenge. I think you guys are gonna freaking love it. But anyway, you guys should definitely check out Nutrition Capital and Sunbury. They are amazing, customer service is great, really wide range of products that uh, we wouldn't be able to get normally at um, other shops. So definitely is gonna be our go-to from now on. But yeah, now we are going to eat a whole tub of ice cream. So Hang and I are gonna smash this. This is only 316 calories for the whole tub. So half each is gonna be around 150 calories, which is barely anything when a, another tub of say like Ben and Jerry's for example would cost like a thousand calories. All right, we're gonna try this out guys. Mm. What do you reckon? It's really good. What flavor is it? Lemon thingy. Wow. How do you pronounce it? How do you, how do you pronounce it? Lemon meringue. What is it? <laughs> Lemon meringue. Oh, okay. <laughs> so it's lemon meringue. Yeah, I see that. You know, I, I would have said lemon meringue. Meringue. But because you said something like. Just eat it properly. Fucking <laughs> like weirdo. This is uh, the pre workout. Good. What flavor ice cream do you guys like? Let me know down below. I usually like cookies and cream. I like, like, 
creamy, anything creamy. This is actually pretty creamy though, even though it's gelato. It's actually really, really good. Mm. Normally, like low calorie ice creams has um, a powdery, a powdery, yeah, powdery taste. But this is actually quite creamy, especially for gelato. Matter. But I think maybe we can go half, 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 and then have a tub of popcorn. So Oh yeah. You half and then me uh, half and then half popcorn, half popcorn. The popcorn we made last night, Coach, um, Coach Greg's anabolic popcorn, pretty freaking sick. It's actually pretty good. We changed the recipe a little bit, so it's a bit lower in calories. We didn't use as much fiber fiber, but yeah, it tastes just as good. I don't think you need that much. His recipe said you needed um. 80 grams of vital fiber. How much did you put? I used 40 for two of us. Oh yeah. Oh, turned out really nice. Yeah. It still covered every piece of popcorn. Yeah. It? But yeah, if you guys don't know, Nutrition Capital were kind enough to sponsor the competition. So they funded the prizes. They funded um, prize one. And um, we funded prize number two. So big shout out to them. Super kind. Do that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to you if you're hiding this <laughs> Man, you're about to tell me off for slamming my shoulder. Huh? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you put your lips together. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> don't worry. No worries. Keep doing what you're doing. <laughs> Finally made home. It's been a super long day. Finally had a gym session. Did about an hour on the Stairmaster. Now we're actually gonna eat some food. We're eating some Korean fried chicken. Oh, ignore the oh, dirty plates. Uh, we've got um, Korean fried chicken with some salad and some, uh, some sauce. This is usually our go-to, not really our cheap meal, but when we have a little bit more calories to spare, it's made just protein, bit of carbs from the batter and a bit of fat from the oil, but uh, Hang's having it with a bowl of rice. I just normally have it with the salad. Yeah, it's usually our favorite. But anyway, that is the whole box of prizes that we ended up with. Some of it is our personal stuff. Most of that is gonna be the prizes. After we eat, I've got client check-ins to do, and then I wanna sign up for the day, and I'll catch you guys later. All right, guys, so now we're at the gym. Um, the one day that we actually wanna record live vlog style, the music's so loud. I've got my friend Ed in here. He just helped me at the gym at the same time. And hang here as well. Uh, we'll take you through our workout today. And uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy. All right guys, so first off, I usually like to do battle raises, just to warm up, get some blood into the shoulders. Sorry if the music's a bit loud, but we'll make do. All right, so for those of you guys that do lateral raises, but you don't feel it in your shoulders, a quick tip is uh, keep your collarbone down, and as you raise out, don't think about raising. Because when you think about raising, you might incorporate your traps. Think about the weight moving away from you as far away as possible with your collarbone being down. And then instead of going all the way down, go to about 80% and then back up, and you're going to feel the burn there. All right, so I'm just resting in between the set. Today we are doing a lot of planning for the 14 day challenge. By the time you guys are watching this, it would have been uh, announced and um, released already. We're super excited to do the 14 day challenge. It's uh, a lot of work. It's really to help give back, give everyone momentum into the year 2021. 2020 was a tough year for a lot of people, gaining a lot of weight. Um, some people even lost their jobs. Their life was just in shambles. So it's the least that we can do uh, in terms of the value that we can provide, get everyone back into momentum so that they can start the year on a strong note. Exercise number two is bench press. Now, some of you guys may know I do have a shoulder impingement that I gotta deal with. I've been trying to do dumbbells for the last couple of weeks, but it's been uh, acting up a little bit. So bench, I feel quite comfortable with. Um, I'll see what I can get today. Uh, on the bench at home, it's actually much harder for me to get past 90 to 100 because the, the bench itself is so narrow, I lose stability. This is a wider bench, so I'm actually interested to see how much I can get. I really wanna try to get 100, but I don't know, we'll, we'll see, we'll give it a go. And uh, what, what are you gonna do today? 40 kilos. She's yeah. gonna try 40 kilos. <laughs> warm up number two, I started on 60, now it's gonna be on 80. Still a warm up. Um, I, I usually work my way up, I'll try to get five of this, go up to 90, see how I feel, go 95, and then we'll try 100. Thank 
kilos I've got right here giving me a spot. So um, aim for five. If I can get five good, then I'm probably gonna go up, we'll try 100. See how we go. so he wouldn't fall on her. So we'll count as 95%. She's 95% there. I reckon next time she'll be able to get it. Done, easy, five. Uh, so I'm gonna go down to 90 and get a bigger set. I'm gonna aim for maybe eight to 10. I don't think I'll get 10, but I'll aim for it. Tony? I'm not sure. Enough, uh, that's <laughs> enough skin for one day, boys. Are you gonna censor this? Yeah. Censor it. Censor the nipples. <laughs>
way. Lean back. Arms straight. My turn to tell you how many reps. <laughs> <laughs>